Bride of Higara. This is Captain Soban of the fleet, Farron Shah. Looks like you could use a hand. Attention all Sobani, pick your targets and engage. Hello everyone, this is Captain Soban. There we go. Hopefully you'll be able to hear me better. Um, welcome aboard. This is the monthly update video for the channel. Uh, it is now March. March 2022. Time is going by so fast. Like, my brain is still in the mode that we're in 2021. <laughs> because not much has really happened this, um, for me this year other than um, working more on hobbies, uh, both me and my parents and um, the, doing my work uh, at my job so I can pay my bills. That, that's about it. <laughs> Nothing super exciting has really been happening. But speaking of hobbies, uh, in my personal life, my mom has gotten really, really good at growing indoor plants. So I'll show you a couple pictures going on right now where we have kind of like a small indoor garden going on right now. Um, so we can have our own lettuce and our own uh, um, tomatoes and whatnot, they'll be ready to put out in the uh, in the garden once it warms up and and stops getting below freezing because uh, apparently we have a couple more winter storms coming in where I live and for March, I mean March has always been a really fickle month for us. Sometimes March is really hot like today. We're supposed to get close to 80 degrees Fahrenheit or like 27 degrees Celsius. I think that's the right conversion. Yeah, because 30 is 86. So I think 27 is the correct one. The correct one which uh, would be a record for us because we don't get that hot in um, in March. We usually don't get into the 80s. So, yeah. Um, and then next week we're supposed to have a snowstorm. So <laughs> our weather has just been really, really strange. Um, but honestly, where I live, you kind of get used to it um, after a while. So that's what's going on in kind of my, my life. Uh, personal life, just working at a grocery store. Um, making money to pay my bills and making YouTube videos and doing Twitch streams uh, whenever uh, I have time. And I've been getting a lot more into Twitch streaming. I, I'm, and the more I do it, the more I enjoy it compared to making YouTube videos. Because I do enjoy making YouTube videos, but um, being able to hang out with people um, in real time to me is a lot more fun than making projects for you guys. Uh, I mean, I'm still going to continue making YouTube videos, that's not going to stop, but I'm probably going to start gearing more towards focusing on streaming and focusing on um, on making YouTube videos. And speaking of that, uh, be, um, I have decided that for the secondary channel, I'm just going to make that into a, um, a streaming vlog st uh, channel, it's, uh, because um, I think that would be a lot um, make a lot more sense because it's still going to go for the same purpose of the secondary channel which is just to play games that are not space related um because i'm planning to play like donkey kong country or like super mario 64 or like a lot of my childhood games and then maybe we might play final fantasy or uh, tales of arise like a little bit of everything i want to stream a little bit of everything and not focus on one genre we i will be streaming like homeworld and whatnot but that's not going to be the sole uh, purpose Honestly, for me, streaming is just a way to hang out and talk to you guys while playing some of my uh, favorite video games, which I think is what it's supposed to be anyways. So yeah, um, if you guys want to join me, um, I'll have my Twitch channel in the video description so you guys can head over there and hit the follow button so you guys know whenever I go live and you can hang out with me. Uh, normally I like to go live between 7 p.m. Central Time to um, 10 or 11 p.m. Uh, central time sometimes midnight it depends on how much fun I'm having and how much I'm enjoying it because uh, I have noticed like a couple times when I stream I'm like oh man it's midnight crap I gotta go to bed because I got work in the morning I don't want to want to keep playing <laughs> and I like that feeling I like it a lot so there is a possibility that we might be going um, just expect the stream to be anywhere between three to five hours so um, anyways uh, for the main channel we're still going to be focusing on the three series we currently have going on, which is Genesis Rising, uh, uh, Free Space, and um, the Homeworld Tactical Fleet Simulator, where we're going to be focusing on the uh, Ship Showcase series for that, since we've done a little bit of skirmish um, matches. And I have messed around with some of the... Um, Oh, what do you call it? The different skirmish modes, because there's a lot of different modes, but some of them don't seem to be working properly. 
and I don't know if it's because we're using the Steam version um, to run it, and maybe it works better on the CD version. I don't know. I haven't figured that out. But some of the modes um, will crash, and when some of the modes actually load, um, nothing will happen. Like, I tried the Survivor mode, which I was really excited about, but the AI never sent anything to me. They just... Yeah, we just sat there for probably like 15, 20 minutes building up a fleet and the waves came in. And I had them set for like five minutes. So, yeah, I might do a little bit more testing with those modes in my free time. And if I find some of them that are cool, I might make a video on it or we might stream some of it. I don't know. I haven't quite decided on that. But anyways, uh, that's that's what's going on the main channel and the secondary channel and the streaming life. <laughs> uh, any... Um, for my personal life, not really a whole lot's been going on. I've ordered a couple new things for my computer. Uh, one of them is a, a USB 3.1 to USB 3.0 um, hub, which I can use to, uh, to plug additional USB cables into my computer because I'm out of USB ports. I have 11 of them on my computer and all of them are being used. <laughs> And I want to hook up my virtual reality system to maybe one day do some recordings or maybe streaming because I think streaming will be easier for VR. Um, I want to stream uh, um, Skyrim and VR and I want to stream um, American Truck Simulator in VR. But I need more USB ports to hook it up because I don't know how well I can see it. But I got my VR system right here. I just have no way to hook it up at the moment. I'm out of USB ports so that's something I want to do in the future and then I'll probably put that stuff on the vlog channel uh, I think the equipment for that should be in in a couple days so we should hopefully be able to get that going soon um other than that for my personal life that's about it it's I've been kind of boring this past like month I mean, I've been chatting with my friends and whatnot, and we've been hanging out, playing games, and watching Pokemon. Um, oh, that's one thing I started. Um, I wa started watching Pokemon again with one of my um, buddies, and we just fe finished uh, season four, I believe it was. Yeah, one of the the first seasons for the Johto series. So we keep sending pictures of each of each other of of like a Pikachu or like a Cyndaquil or whatever. <laughs> We've both really gotten back into that. And in my free time, I've been watching Yu-Gi-Oh! The original series, because I'd never actually finished that. And now that I'm getting older, I'm actually enjoying some more of those like dark stories and whatnot. Because um, Yu-Gi-Oh! I will admit, I don't think that was for kids. It came on uh, Saturday morning cartoons um, back in the day, which any of you guys don't know that. Um, in America, back in like the 90s and early 2000s, there was a um, channel... Uh, I don't think it was a news channel. It was just, um, it was for me, it was Channel 11. I don't know what it was for all you guys out there, but they would have Saturday morning cartoons where you would have the uh, Maniacs, um, Dexter's Laboratory. Uh, I don't think it was Dexter's. I think that was Cartoon Network. But you would have Yu-Gi-Oh! and Pokemon. You would have all these on like Saturday morning cartoons. And as, as an adult watching Yu-Gi-Oh!, it was not for kids. <laughs> There's a lot of like dark themes into that game um, or into that show that nowadays you would definitely look at it and be like, oh, this isn't for kids. This is for teenagers because yeah, it's about, I mean, the, 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 the concept of the whole show, show is um, about the Yu-Gi-Oh trading card. But the anime was more about the um, rescuing your grandpa because he got kidnapped by this person or rescuing your brother because someone's hold holding them hostage and the only way to beat them is by beating them in this card game. Like there was some there's some dark uh, dark elements to that series. I like it though. I, I really am enjoying it and um, hopefully one day I'll actually finish Yu-Gi-Oh! I think the first I got was like halfway through season three and then I stopped watching it and I don't remember why I stopped watching it. I think it's because whatever like show or whatever um, website I was using to watch the channels only had up to season three and I found it on Amazon. I was like, oh my god, there's five seasons? There's more to this that I don't know about? <laughs> so I decided to just completely restart it. But anyways, that's what's going on in my personal life and what's going on in my channel life. Um, I don't think there's anything else that's really going on that I'm really aware of. 
um, other getting other than getting more involved in streaming and focusing a little bit more on getting my YouTube stuff going. I think that's about it. That's that's about the entire summary of what's going on in my life. <laughs> uh, it is it is getting warmer. Um, we do still have all of our chicks and whatnot outside. Uh, they're all still alive. Uh, it's funny to watch them uh, move around and uh, like the last month we've had some like really big windstorms and so it's funny how like the chicks will go out and then the wind will pick up and so they'll start huddling together and there'll be a strong gust of wind and one will start moving away and some of them will start chasing it's like no no don't go away <laughs> like their friends just slowly being blown away by the wind and chickens are hilarious um they're they're very curious and they're very entertaining animals um to have have around they they're definitely they're definitely one of a kind anyways guys i think i'm gonna go ahead and end this i don't think there's anything else that's really going on uh, for this month um, as soon as it's available we will be covering the third mission in homeworld um, complex evo i have checked it uh, before i recorded this and it's not available yet so as soon as that's available that's going to be going up on the channel and as soon as we get a dev build because it the the, uh, the quick kickstarter for era one should be ending here in a couple days after uh, posting this um, so once that's done, and then once they start making the dev builds and sending it out to people who back them, because I was one of the backers, uh, we'll be covering that. We'll be checking it out together. And so we'll have that up on the channel. So hopefully March will be very busy for the channel, and and hopefully we'll get a lot of new faces and whatnot that are enjoying um, the Homeworld universe. And yeah, hopefully everything just goes according to mine. But yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and end this here, guys. I hope you enjoy this. Please leave a like if you did. If you like what I do, consider subscribing. And I will check you guys out in the next video. Until then, this is Captain Sovan signing out. The Baker have arrived. Emergency hyperspace procedures initiated.